of, quote, Trump's populist protégés, like Mr. Ramaswamy, are a road to ruin for the GOP. If the government shuts down, should voters blame populist Republicans? Voters should blame everybody who's in Washington, D.C. They get sent down there to do the job, and they've been failing at doing the job for a very long time. And let's be honest about this with the voters. You know, during the Trump administration, they added $7 trillion, $7 trillion in national debt. And now the Biden administration has put another $5 trillion on and counting. They have failed, and they're in the spot they're in now because none of them are willing to tell the truth. None of them are willing to take on the difficult issues. They just want to keep kicking the can down the road. And the inflation that Nikki spoke about is absolutely right, and it's caused by government spending. And that's why people all across this country are suffering tonight. And yet we don't get any answers because Joe Biden hides in his basement and won't answer as to why he's raising the debt the way he's done. And Donald Trump he hides behind the walls of his golf clubs and won't show up here to answer questions like all the rest of us are up here to answer. He put seven trillion on the debt. He should be in this room to answer those questions for the people you talk about who are Can suffering. And if the government and if the government closes and if the government closes, it's the blame. It is to the blame of everyone in Washington, D.C., who has failed to do their job and just plays to the grandstand. The next question is for Governor DeSantis.